Hey, hey, Tauruses. Hello, Taurus. This is a full moon. Thank you for being back. Tauruses, let's see what is going on for you guys. Alrighty. So, 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 Tauruses. Let's see what is happening. Thank you for being here. Please remember, welcome all newcomers. I hope you'll stay. Please like and share these videos and thumbs up. All right, newcomers. Uh, thank you. All right, Tauruses, let's see what's happening. Your wishes and dreams is going to be coming through, Tauruses. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, um, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming through. So this is good. Congratulations, you Tauruses. Nine of Cups in Upright, um, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming out. Then we recognize there was some sort of a secrecy and whatever is happening, I see that a lot of you Tauruses are going to be connecting with your mighty I am present. This is good. Um, this is as if uh, this full moon is bringing you Tauruses just wonderful exhilar exhilaration of connecting with your spirit guide, but also of uh, other um magical um situation is going to be happening and transpiring i love the energy of this moon i think that this card deck is one of my favorites because of uh, so much information and details how they have done this i feel so i really connected um when you look at the situation your wishes and dreams is going to be coming through and a lot of information that was kept and secrecy is going to be coming out and this is going to be good so major arcana both for sun and moon sign people then i see the page of cups um the page of cups this is a situation that some of you could be dealing with a child some of you um could be trying to get pregnant and that sort of a thing it's going to be happening some of you new love could be coming in um because it is facing you guys so a lot of you if you're looking for love new love could be coming in then we have the energy of the swords communication secrets are going to be coming out and this is beside the energy of the moon where secrets are going to be coming out whatever secrets that was kept it is now going to be coming out is this is as if the universe and um the guides and uh, i've come together to recognize that this information needs to come out it's as if some sort of a secrecy um that was kept is now going to be coming out in the third week, a lot of you are going to be leaving a situation behind, moving forward to better water. This is good. Um, some of you could be just taking your kids and just moving and relocating to another city. This is going to be good because you're going to be recognizing that maybe this is uh, the best thing to do. Okay, just take your kid, take your family and relocate to another city. I see um, you're looking at a better horizon um, by relocating. Another major arcana, a cycle is, yeah, is not over. And this is going to be affecting especially um, some of you that had new love. Some sort of a cycle is not yet over. There could be some sort of a conflict, confusion, but yet still um, this um, love is going to be staying intact. Okay, Not every day it is a good day for love. Sometimes you have conflicts. But it's not to walk away from this relationship. The fourth week, um, we have the magician, another major arcana. You guys have major arcana. Um, this is like the first reading with major arcana. So, okay. So you have the magician and this is like, you can move and live anywhere you want to live in the world because you have a, a magical, everything that you need, everything that you want, everything that you want to create in your world, you can do it because no matter where you live in the world, um, you have uh, the power, the tools to manifest whatever it is uh, that you need to manifest. And this is going to be good. Then I see that um, a whole lot of you are going to be recognizing something about a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion person. If there was some sort of a conflict, some sort of a situation, it is not yet over. Maybe this was a lover. This it could have been a Cancer who had a lot of secrets. I see information is now coming out. People are now recognizing who this person is. I see that you guys have the, the tools in order to resolve the situation. Some of you Tauruses, this could be your mom. Um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, they're not showing up who she is, but this could be your mom. And whatever is happening and transpiring, you have the tools in order to, re um, to, um, release and, um, re embed what is going on because you are now going to be recognizing 
that whoever this person is, so maybe it's your wife, maybe it's your mom, maybe it's your mother in law, your sister, whoever this person is, whether a family member or someone you're dealing with in your professional life, a cycle is not yet over because they're investigating this person. They could have recognized that this person have created some sort of a criminal offense, or however it is coming up, however it is transpiring, they're going to know, they're now going to be finding out who this person is and what this person has done. All right, so a lot of you, mm, a lot of you, what is happening and transpiring, you could be um, be successfully overcoming a situation where a young person, whoever this young person is, could have used some sort of uh, data information um, in order to travel and get some sort of a status stability in the country. They're going to be recognizing and finding out what this person has done. And you are going to be happily overcoming the situation because this person had a secret. Whether this young person is from another country or another region, had some sort of a secret and it's all going to be coming out. OK, so you're going to be finding out that someone who is from another country, another religion, another background, have some sort of a secret. And people are now going to be recognizing and it is all going to be coming out. Your wishes and dreams is going to be um you're going to be happy because your wishes and dreams is coming out because they're recognizing something of a young traveler. OK, then we see some sort of a reunion taking place in the second week. And this is reunion with a love reunion with a child. Some sort of a communication is coming in from a child that you haven't heard from in a long time or some sort of a reunion with a love some some of you were in some sort of a new relationship and there was some sort of a conflict and then all of a sudden you two are going to be getting back in the second week. A whole lot of communication over um, kids is going to be coming in also in the second week. So be aware of this because the communication is as if this needs to be done because we need to talk about whether or not we're going to be having kids, what we're going to be doing with the kids when the kids leave that sort of a situation. So I see um, a renovation of a kid room, that sort of a situation could be coming up. But I see reunion is coming in and this is going to be good. So a lot of you who had some sort of a conflicts with a new love that you are having, they're going to be returning in the second week. Third week, a lot of you are waiting, waiting, waiting for information and message to whether to know whether or not you're going to be moving forward. So you're waiting, waiting on a whole lot of information and message in order to <clears throat> recognize whether or not you're going to be moving forward. And it's as if the waiting is long, but it is going to be coming through, but the waiting is long. You have the major arcana of uh, um, um, the world and it is saying it is not yet time to move. It is not yet time to relocate. It is not yet time. Um, in time, you will know when it is time. OK, so I see a lot of you are thinking whether or not I should leave, whether or not I should go live in a new city or whatever. But it's as if uh, the angels and guides is saying it's not yet time. Your purpose is not yet finished where you are. In the fourth week, fourth and last week, I see a lot of you are going to be recognizing and finding out something about a Pisces Cancer Scorpion woman. It could be a friend. This person is coming up as a friend. And I see you're going to be recognizing and I see that some of you are going to be recognizing I have the tools in my hand that I can help this person. And however it is going to be happening and transpiring, you're going to be recognizing who this person is. Um, it is a friend for some of you. It is a friend and you're going to be recognizing that maybe you have the tools in your hands to help this person out of some sort of a problem that they have gotten themselves in. And you're going to be trying to resolve the situation in a correct way. So whatever is happening in transpiring, you're going to be there for a friend that is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion. This person is down and out, but you're definitely going to be there for this person. You are now going to be recognizing and seeing the truth of what was happening, what was transpiring, what was playing, and what was being created. A whole lot of you, someone from um, overseas is going to be traveling towards you or from another city. Someone is going to be coming home. So, you know, um, Easter is coming up. So that could be a situation where um, someone could be coming home to you. A lot of things with kids are going to be here. New love. 
um it's going to be here happiness and joy a lot of you were worried about your child overseas um you didn't know what was happening that sort of a situation and they are going to be popping up of at easter all right let's see what is happening for the sun sign people this is a people that was born 6 a.m to 6 p.m what is happening um all right so the high princess is bringing out a whole lot of information so whenever the high princess and the moon is in a reading this is two major 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 arcana and it's all about secrecy it's intuition it's secrecy it's things that was been kept it's about you listening to your intuition recognizing that your intuition was correct and and um and realizing that you know you were right even though you didn't want to listen to your own intuition you were right and now all the information is coming out people are now recognizing and seeing the truth of something that was transpiring and bringing balance and balancing out the situation so a lot of you sun sign people are going to be dealing with secrecy secrecy is coming out a whole lot of secrecy is coming out people are going to be recognizing um, that there was some sort of a double play that was transpiring where people were have created some sort of a duplication of some sort of a travel documents. Now they're going to be recognizing it can be travel documents because we see the energy of the journey that someone is journeying and they're going to be recognizing that a young person have created some sort of a copy of some sort of a travel documents and they're going to be recognizing that some sort of a travel documents was duplicated okay and they're going to be now seeing the truth and recognizing that someone had duplicated some sort of a traveling documents for your child or for yourself but uh, you're going to be victoriously successfully overcoming this because they're going to be recognizing that your travel documents and information was duplicated it have something to do with a journey it have something to do with a child the two duplication that there was double so they're now going to be recognizing and seeing the truth and recognizing that people had duplicate some sort of a travel document so judgment is coming down but it's positive this is one of these moments um, it's it's coming down on a young person whoever this young person is judgment is coming down on this young person because now they're recognizing what this young person have uh, done whoever this young person is and whoever has uh, access a uh, young person information they're going to be recognizing that uh, um someone had sucks um uh, as um duplicate some sort of a drop travel documents it could be yours or you could be finding it out so i see that you could be bringing out this information um because there were secrets that was kept or um did you guys have something to do with it or now you're recognizing it or you're showing up that some sort of a travel documents information was duplicated and they're now going to be recognizing that so the judgment call for some of you sun signs people are really good because your wishes and dream is going to be coming in they are now going to be recognizing that there was uh, someone who duplicates some sort of an information from, from from a child so they're going to be investigating and recognizing that a child information was duplicated or someone um information was duplicated or that someone has stolen information and gave to their lovers they're going to be recognizing that someone was on someone else's computer that stolen some sort of information and gave to their lovers or some of you your lovers are going to be looking in your phone and recognizing that you were fooling around with someone else but it has to do with computer mail um um your phone mail text message um some of you it could show up that you have been seeing someone else on the side um it's some of you is that they're going to be finding out that your partner is making arrangement to meet someone else so a whole lot is coming out and it is via the telephone or the email or computer that you're going to be recognizing and seeing that your partner has been fooling around with someone else all right so expect that uh, but some of you you're going to be finding out that the data of your child was duplicated oh well this is the page of pentacles so the page of pentacles a lot of you are waiting for money to move forward 
a lot of you are hoping and waiting for this money to come in so that you can move forward a lot of you could be waiting on some sort of a back pay to come in um and this is going to be good some of you are waiting for some money to um go and get a new apartment or relocate to another city or another place i see you are waiting and this is in um the third week where you are waiting for this bill to pay or this money to come in a lot of you are going to be taking your kid and relocate to somewhere else you're going to be recognizing jesus this is just so horrible this place i can't grow up my kids here and you're going to be um relocating because you recognize that um the your, your information or your kid information people could have paid and duplicate your kid information and they're going to be recognizing the foul play of what has transpired in the last week a very good week is going to be first week and last week is going to be very good for you guys a new start is going to be coming in the ace of cups you have the energy of the ace of cups twice sun sign people and some sort of a problem um we're going to recognize that your partner was cheating on you and then um at the end of the um, month is as if, you know, it's good. Um, it's good. You know, I'm good. Just let it go. I'm okay. I'll be okay. Um, so just let go of this situation. New love is definitely going to be coming in. So whoever is looking for a new love, um, the fourth week is going to be good. A lot of new love is going to be coming in and there is going to be a wonderful alignment of energy that is going to be happening and transpiring where new love is going to be coming in. So this is going to be good. So, um, wonderful, um, situation, wonderful play, um, that is happening and transpiring. People are now going to be recognizing, um, what was going on and people are going to be seeing and recognizing that new love is going to be coming in and they're going to be understanding the play, um, that was transpiring and how, um, a lot of you, um, there was some sort of a problem with your kids, and this is going to be resolved and they're going to be recognizing that some sort of an invoice judgment call is coming down because they're going to be recognizing that someone information was duplicated and they're going to be recognizing and finding out that people had access some sort of an information. There was some sort of a data breach and data theft. And a lot of you are going to be taking your kid and just moving away and said, yes, I never, ever expect this to happen. For the rest of you guys, you're going to be recognizing that there was some sort of a, um, some of you, your partners were cheating and you're going to be having evidence of this. A lot of you are going to be waiting for some sort of a payout that should have come out and is still not there. And a lot of you are going to be recognizing that your best friend, um, is the person that you should be with is your soulmate or twin flame. You're going to be recognizing that you, um, a relationship is going to be going another step because uh, it is as if uh, is your best friend is your soulmate or twin flame. So that is good. All right, let's move on to the moon sign of people. All right, so if you were born 6 a.m. to 6 p.m., 6 p.m. to 6 a.m., this is your reading. So I see multiple opportunities of a lot of emotions, emotions, emotions. A lot of emotions, a lot of emotional uh, situation is here. Another emotional situation are playing around you. Emotion situation with friends, emotional situation with a scorpion. Whoever the scorpion is, a whole lot of emotional situation for you and a scorpion that is going to be happening and transpiring. So this is all about emotional and it can be very positive because it's now um, in the upright. It's a whole lot of positive emotion that a lot of you and your friends could be having positive, you know, really connecting on a high energy level. You're feeling good. You know, a lot of people, you're meeting a lot of people. Um, you know, you're seeing what, you know, all of what is transpiring. You're recognizing and seeing, um, the situation that is transpiring. A lot of you are dealing with a scorpion. Okay. And I see heartbreaks for the scorpion woman, whoever the scorpion woman is. It could have, it could be a friend. Heartbreaks is here for the scorpion woman. Um, whatever that was happening and transpiring, whether this is your wife, your ex-wife, whoever this person is, I see heartbreak for a scorpion woman. 
um you know this could be a friend but whatever is happening there's a whole lot of heartbreaks and the scorpion is going through a whole lot of problems and it's as if the problems is not ending so whoever the scorpion is and whatever is transpiring the scorpion is going through a whole lot of problems and it's as if her problems are just escalating out of control so be aware of this that heartbreaks for a friend and multiple heartbreaks is going to be coming up for a friend because they recognize something about this friend and who this friend is. So a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming a situation that a scorpion woman had created for you and your family. They are now recognizing and seeing the truth that a scorpion woman and her husband had created a whole lot of problems. And they're now coming down and recognizing and seeing um, what these people have done and created because it's like a family unit, their husband and wife. Whoever the scorpion is, is a family unit. And she and her husband, the um, secrecy and uh, um, what they do together and what they create and the play that they do against other people and their families. And I see um, the scorpion couple is now very saddened because they recognize that the scorpion couple had really played against you. And I see truths are going to be coming out and they're going to be really recognizing what the scorpion couple have done. So whoever the scorpion couple is, they're now recognizing the truth of the scorpion couple. Wow, you guys have double whammy, double whammy, twi twice the energy of the world. Wow, Tauruses, this is good. Um, the, the, the huge problem in, um, the second week for you, um, Tauruses, you moon sign Tauruses is that a cycle is not yet over and you're waiting for the cycle to over. And here you have, for some of you, a cycle is not over. For some of you, a cycle is. You were waiting, waiting, waiting in the second week and whatever that was happening and transpiring in the second week, whatever you are waiting from is finally going to be coming to an end. So it's as if a lot of you Tauruses were waiting, waiting, um, trying to figure out and trying to resolve some sort of an issue with them, some sort of a problem. And now the waiting is going to be over and they're going to be now recognizing that there was some sort of an unsavory, unconventional situation. And um, whatever that was pulling out this waiting, you were just waiting. It's like you're waiting in vain. But finally, a new start. So in the third week, you have the Ace of Swords information came out. And this is going to be giving you a new start. So in the third week, some sort of information came out. Someone could be calling you to um, um, reunite with you, um, whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring. Um, someone is going to be calling and asking to reunite. Okay, so some sort of information where someone is saying, hey, um, should we get back together? Or, you know, I really want to reunite with you or I want to see you. They want a new start. Whoever this person is could be a young child that is coming in and said, hey, mom, um, can I come and stay with you? Or, hey, um, you know, call up your, you guys and say, hey, can I come home? It could be a child that is calling up and say, hey, can I come home? And I see that you're going to be happily saying yes to this person. And however this is going to be happening and transpiring, you are definitely going to be saying yes to this person because I see that a lot of you have lost contact with this person. It is COVID. You have been very, very saddened about what has transpired. All right. The energy of the moon in the last week for you moon sign people. So um, deceptiveness, deceptiveness. So the energy of the moon um, is bringing out deceptiveness. And this is what I said, uh, ladies and gentlemen, these reading are based on long um, timeless, but also moon energy. That's why I do the full moon reading because it reveals a lot of things that people were not aware of. Okay. This full moon energy. And now the last week for you moon sign people, the moon is here and secrets is coming out, whatever that was happening and transpiring. A whole lot of secrets is coming out that was um, secrecy that was kept underneath the table and it is all now coming out. And they're recognizing that a young traveler, whoever this young traveler is, or someone from another country or another region has duplicated some sort of a data and documentation, some sort of a travel documents or duplicate something. And they're now recognizing the seven of swords. So a lot of you Tauruses is going to be recognizing and seeing the truth of some sort of an unconventional play from a young traveler. Whoever this young traveler is, their secrets is going to be coming out that they have duplicated 
or a you Taurus is were the one who could have duplicated someone else's family information in order to give this young traveler. And they're now going to be understanding and seeing the foul play that was happening and transpiring. So um, a lot of you secrets are going to be coming out and it's secrets about some sort of a deceptive play of some sort of a duplication of data and information that was duplicated. And met. people are now going to be recognizing that there was really some sort of a foul play that has happened and transpiring. People are now going to be seeing the truth. A family is going to be definitely getting a start because they're going to be recognizing that a scorpion um, couple had created some issues. And a lot of you who were waiting on some sort of information is finally going to be coming true. And they're going to be recognizing the reunion because family member is going to be coming to you and coming back to you and saying, hey, um, you know, sorry that I haven't been in touch for some time. But, you know, can we pick up where we left off? Can we talk about things? And this is going to be good. Whatever the secret is that was keeping, people are going to be recognizing that there was a really full play that was happening and transpiring. I do love you guys. I gotta say namaste. Until next time, enjoy. Um, thumbs up in order for the um the videos can pick up the algorithm. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you want to see the extended of this where you see your 12 houses, what is going on in your 12 houses. Use the second abandonment, the second subscription. So by the join button, when you choose join, you choose a second subscription. I gotta go. I do love you. Namaste.